pages my calls for comments on a possible defender season two. Thank you, Jason. I, I, I remember hearing this some flat some talk about this before. I remember hearing about it. And well, they weren't really too sure because everyone's conflicting schedules, but Luke Cage star Michael Coulter was in attendance at Baltimore Comic Con this weekend and was asked by a fan whether or not there'll be a Defender Season 2. The eight-episode miniseries released on, was released on Netflix in 2017 and brought together the heroes from four different shows, Luke Cage, Iron Fist, Daredevil, and Jessica Jones. A major barrier to a second season of the Defenders is scheduling. Netflix's VP of Original Content, Cindy Holland, recently explained that the biggest issue was the timing of the production and the launching of the Defenders because what that meant is that we had to shut down all the shows so all the actors could be available. And quote, but while there aren't any current plans for the Defender Season 2, Marvel TV boss Jeb Zolob has said that it's not off the table, and often an intriguing suggestion that a second season could feature a different lineup of superheroes. According to comicbook.com, Paul Strad first teased the Baltimore Comic Con by, by saying, That crowd wasn't loud enough for the Defenders 2, sorry. When the fans got louder in response, he changed his mind saying, Alright, alright. Maybe we can do something. While that certainly indicates that the is open to a second season of the TMO show, it's also very non-committal. It didn't indicate that there's still nothing officially on the slate. I mean, obviously, I mean, they're all doing some stuff. Superior crossovers can be a lot of fun, can be a lot of fun, which is why the CW's Arrowverse does them every year. But they're also quite tricky to pull off successfully. The Defenders was charged with bringing together the main characters of four different shows, picking up plot threads that had been established in individual shows, and balancing screen time and focus between the four character superheroes, all while trying to tell a, a cohesive story. It's a little wonder that many fans were disappointed in the end result. Luke Cage Season 2 offered an alternative approach by having Iron Fist's Ben Jones get star in an episode, temporarily teaming up with Luke again. Rather than trying to pull all four characters together for another season of The Defenders, it might be better to simply have them keep popping up in each other's shows for an episode or two. After all, they all live in the same city, so it makes sense for them to call one another when they need backup. The next chapter in the Marvel slash Netflix universe is Daredevil Season 3, which will pick up after Mark Murdoch's dramatic near death in the Defenders finale. Since his friends all think that he was crushed under a collapsing building, it will be interesting to see whether any of them other any of the other defenders make an appearance this season, if only because of Matt driving by to let them know he's still breathing. This has been your boy Chase. I hope you guys I hope you guys enjoyed that. I really enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think in the conversation below. Make sure you guys hit that like button, hit that subscribe button for more content. If you guys have any ideas on what I should talk about next in my videos, let me know in the conversation below or private message me in the backside of my YouTube page. This has been your been your boy Chase. God bless.